What's going on, Internet? It is your boy, Eric Banholtz, back again with another awesome episode from Beard Brand. And today, I want to teach you how to take your beard from this to this in under five minutes. All right, to get this look, you are going to need a comb, a hairdryer, and yes, some Beard Brand utility balm. You'll see my beard is still damp. I have just hopped out of the shower. I washed it today with some beard wash and I followed it up with some beard softener. And that's not always a daily routine for me, but for consistency's sake, uh, I'm doing it for this tutorial. Now I'll comb through my beard to really just get all the tangles out. It's not for any styling purpose or anything like that. And with the utility balm, I'm just grabbing a little dollop, you'll see there, and work it into the hands until uh, it's completely emulsified and, and gives a nice glow to your hands. From there, you just work it into the beard. You guys have seen these videos before on how to apply beard oil, how to apply balm. It's a real similar technique. Again, you wanna focus on getting it not only into your beard, but you wanna make sure that you are getting it into your skin beneath, because with a healthy skin, you're gonna to start to grow a healthy beard and it's gonna start looking the, the finest it can be. You'll avoid any kind of like flakes and, and uh, scaliness that you get with that skin. You'll notice I've got some uh, balm left over, so I just uh, rub it into my arms, rub it into my body, wherever I need. Now with this technique, I do a four directional technique. I start from my neck and go up. You'll see, start from the neck, go up to my chin. What I'm trying to do here is get rid of those big curls that really go from my uh, my jawline down uh, to my neck and kind of curl inwards. And then from there, you'll see uh, in the future that I, I'm blowing from my right side to the left, and then I alternate it, and then I go from my left side to the right, and finally I go from my chin back down to my neck. Now, my blow dryer is on a medium heat, medium speed right now. A lot of you guys are like terrified of a blow dryer and you think your, your beard's just gonna fall apart if you use any kind of heat on it. You know, the, the, the best analogy I would make for this is like imagine you're uh, riding your bicycle down a, a pretty quick hill on a hot day in the summer. That's the same effect you're having to your beard. So if you live life, you're gonna be damaging your beard but it's not to the point where it's gonna make it look terrible, ratty, split end, and all that. So your beard can handle a lot, guys. Don't be afraid to, uh, to use a blow dryer to help you get to the look that you need. The other thing I wanna mention is using a blow dryer and using tools to get you to the look that you want doesn't make you less masculine or less of a man. If anything, it's equivalent to you going to the gym to bulk up a little bit more to look better, or going to get a haircut, or styling your hair, or putting on deodorant, or washing yourself, any grooming technique, this is just another aspect of this. And not only that, I'm not telling you that you've gotta do this. What I'm doing is I'm showing people out there who wanna do it, how to do it. So after uh, blow drying my beard, pretty much mostly dry, I give it one more fluff. Again, the goal is to, to separate the beard hairs so that they can all kind of lay back on each other and have like this uniformity and a, a, a kind of a clean look to it, but still have that natural curl that, that's in a, in a beard. With the mustache, again, I, I'm blowing it from the side and using a, a lot of the technique is, is with the finger to be able to, to almost have that natural curl and uh, rub your mustache through those fingers to, to give it that little curl. The final step I'll have is just uh, more of a re refining process, really. Like, so I've, I'm, I'm probably like 80% there now. I'm blow drying my beard down to, to kind of get the, the basic shape. And really, this is just like the, the fine adjustments that depending on your, your OCD-ness is how much time you're going to invest in this part. But it's just um, tweaking the beard here and there, tweaking the mustache, making sure you're getting the right curls, and then wrapping it up to uh, till your heart's content. So here's the final look, guys. And that's all it takes. This is my daily routine. Hope you guys enjoy. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Cheers. And beard on.